Well, tonight a candlelight vigil held for two people who were killed last week in a shooting and crash in Coachella. A 21 year old man was shot while driving. He lost control and hit two pedestrians, including a Coachella Valley Unified School District teacher who was killed. News Channel 3's Jake Ingracia is live tonight with more on how they are being remembered. Jake. John, good evening and such a tragic story here tonight. It was less than a week ago, just up the street from here, that that car was shot at. At this hour, you can see friends and family kneeling in front of the memorial that's risen up tonight. The driver struck by gunfire, losing control, as you said, striking two people. One of them was killed. And tonight, both of those lives lost are being remembered. Music, candles, Hugs and prayers. That's how friends and family remember 21 year old Jason Verdugo Jr. and Westside Elementary School teacher Gabriela Salazar at a vigil Thursday night. Both killed in Coachella last week as the result of a car to car shooting. Verdugo was driving near Avenue 50 in Calhoun when a bullet struck him. His car, carrying two other passengers, crashed onto the sidewalk, striking two people, killing Salazar. My reaction, uh, uh, of course, is, is sadness and. Uh, and uh, sorrow, you know. Aaron Aguilar is Verdugo's uncle. Surrounded by loved ones Thursday night, he says they're clinging to their faith. I get my peace through the Holy Spirit, through the Lord. That's where I get my comfort. So if you ask me how I'm coping with this situation, it's my relationship with Jesus Christ. Focusing on the positive and how he wants to remember his nephew. He was a loving, caring, big hearted person always full of joy and every time I would see my nephew it was always with a big smile on his face with empathy and understanding for Salazar's family too tragically another life was taken not just my nephews and um, I just want to apologize from the bottom of my heart Westside Elementary's principal writing in a letter to parents, Mrs. Salazar was an outstanding teacher who cared very deeply about the success and well-being of each and every one of her students. We will all miss her very much and will spend many difficult moments grieving her loss. All those lives touched, vowing not to forget. I know the person that he was, and that's forever going to be with me. That's forever going to stand with me. And tonight, nobody has been taken into custody in connection with that shooting. Verdugo's family has set up a GoFundMe page. If you'd like to help, you can head to our website, KESQ.com. We're live in Coachella tonight. Jake Gracia, News Channel 3.